but it's good, you too, man. Oh, I'm sorry. No. Just kind of waking up. Don't mind me. But um, we currently is at the hospital. Uh, don't look like it, but we are. Um, so I currently got some issues going on. And it's kind of, it could be like 30, but at the same time, it can't. But for my age, it's pretty, it's pretty scary. You know what I'm saying? So I'm here trying to get it figured out. I uh, came here yesterday, uh, been here overnight already. So that's been a lot, bro. If you look at me right now, bro, you'd be like, hold on. Yes, bro, like, like the blood drawer and heart monitor. Um, Y'all, this was, but uh, bro, they just keep they come in and take your vitals every couple of hours, bro. It's so stressful, dog. Like, so, I mean, honestly, what's really going on is uh, I have this thing called AFib. It's basically when the top part of your heart is uh all out of whack, and the bottom part of your heart is in rhythm. They said you don't want the bottom part of your heart to be out of rhythm as well because it can cause stroke. But right now, they said my heart level is at, you know what I'm saying, at a normal heart rate, but I'm still in AFib. Uh -oh. Hope that don't affect anything. But, um, yeah, man, I'm, as you can see, I'm strapped up, yo, so. Yeah, pray for me. Hope everything go okay. Uh, I'll give y'all some updates on what's happening and what's going to go on. But other than that, y'all stay tuned, man. This shit going right dark. I love y'all. Y'all pray for me. Um, I don't see this too bad right now, but you know what I'm saying? Who knows? Things could go about. You know what I mean? So y'all stay tuned. I love y'all. Y'all have a great day. All right, y'all. So <clears throat> we got some good news. We are currently out of AFib. Um, I'm happy as fuck, I'm not gonna lie, because I don't want to get shocked. And it's raining. I really don't want to get shocked, but uh, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, we can stay out of AFib. If we can stay out of AFib, then that means we won't have to go into procedure tomorrow. Hopefully not, because there's, there wouldn't be no point of going to do the procedure if I'm not in AFib. The point of the procedure is to reset, basically reset my heart to where it's not in AFib. And um, they said I'm not an AFib, so hopefully I don't go back into it overnight. I'm going to be in here for another night. Uh, today is Sunday, the 28th of July, 2024. <clears throat> so hopefully, you know what I'm saying, they can tell me that I, I'm, I'm out by, by tomorrow. And you know what I'm saying, just give me some updates on what I can do better or what for the possible case of what's going on could possibly be what well, if i said that right but um your boys out of afib i'm doing a lot better i feel a lot better um i'm not gonna lie i still feel something though i don't think i'm out of afib i, mm, I don't want to say it but honestly i know my body and i don't think i'm out of afib so yeah just pray for me man uh this is can be life threatening like i said um is one of them things where you have to take uh, serious like accountability, you know what I mean? So I'm just glad I'm getting it checked out now instead of later on in life and be like, oh, well, now I'm having strokes and shit. So y'all stay tuned. Uh, we in here chilling. We had some food earlier. My girl just left. I'm sad, but I'm not sad, but I'm sad she left. But at the same time, I'm happy that they said I'm out of AFib, so I don't know. Um, yeah, I kind of got a headache. I'm not going to lie. Um, I probably need to drink a little bit more water because I haven't really been drinking that much water. I've been drinking some water, but not as much as I usually do. I've just been laying down all day, bro. So, yeah. Um, I love y'all, though. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And it's your boy, Martin Dark. We out. All right, y'all. So I'm out of the hospital. Um, yeah. But the good news is that I went out of AFib. So that's why they let me out. I didn't have to get no shock. You know what I'm saying? I didn't have to reset my heart or anything like that. 
because if that, if I still had AFib, then they would have reset my heart basically to where it's pumping back in rhythm. Cause if it's not in rhythm, then that's not good. Like I told y'all before, you know what I'm saying? You don't want one doing this and the other doing this. Because if that's the case, it's gonna cause a stroke. But you know what I'm saying? I'm back in rhythm. Uh, we still don't know what the problem is, so I'm just gonna <clears throat> I'm gonna do a checkup and uh and yeah, just hopefully you know what I'm saying, pray that things get better throughout the time because this can be a very life threatening thing to go through. I don't wanna go through it. But what I was gonna say. Okay, but what I was gonna say, um one second. I do have bad news as well. Um my blood count is low. White blood cell count. My white blood cell count is low. So yeah, that's 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 weird. But at the same time, I already knew because I get sick easily. So, yeah, I, I need to go to my primary doctor and check up with them and see what's going on from there because that's that's bad as well. So, yeah. But uh, I was just giving y'all an update and showing y'all that I am alive. I am here to stay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I appreciate y'all for tuning in, man. I love y'all so much. Appreciate y'all for the support. It's your boy, Mark. Dark man, and we are out, man. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. New channel, go to the